All right, this is a blue shuffle in the key of G. And it's brief, so. But, um, and you can keep going on with it. Say if you're playing a... That's pretty much the uh, the tempo and uh, the chord changes there as well. So it, um, it's going to have some difficult uh, T level to it. So, um, I mean, you can get some valuable stuff out of this if you're both a beginner and an and a intermediate level player. So we're starting on the third string with our second finger, fifth to seventh fret. Now your third finger is already in position there to play. So, five seven on the third string, eighth fret, second string, back to that seventh fret on the third string, and give a vibrato. Notice that I'm playing a like a four one, and then a three one, four one three one. That's kind of a common move as we could say you know repet repetitious pattern that's used in, in the blues or or rock so we're, we're playing we have this and then on the 11th fret on the second string four one tenth fret third string back to that eighth fret second string and then another four four one three one and then you're going to do this quick slide from the eighth to the tenth fret Back from the 10th, 8th to the 10th, 10th to the 8th, then so far we have so there we go. Now the first two measures right there. Here comes a third measure. I'll play the third and fourth measures together. So it's a big full step bend. I like using my third finger. And then a three, five, three, five. So that's all right there in G, right there in that box. Suggest either using your fourth or your third finger. For the full step bend, bring it down. Hammer-on right there at the end. Three, five, three, five. Five, three. Now this part is very interesting. So you're still back in the box. You just boxed out a little bit there. So three, six, three, five, three. Three, six on the sixth string, three, five, three in the fifth, back to the six. Now we're all on the sixth string still, three, one, three, and then that's an octave. So that's the fifth fret of the fourth string. Now a little chromatic going down. Now we're up to the D here. together here First three lines. Finally, that's it right there, the last line right there. So I'll get this close to you. Uh, hopefully you can see this on your phones. I'm still using a laptop myself. 
And I do all my recording with the phone. I should get, should get a better camera at this point in time. So now we're going to be uh, up here in this pentatonic. I have lots of pentatonic uh, shapes in this particular lick. So full step bend on the third string, 17th fret with your third finger. And immediately go to that first string. Then second string. Then a bend on the 18th fret. So 17th, third string. 15th, first string. 18th, uh, second. And then... That's, I think that's pretty crucial. The, the slide on the fourth string from the 17th fret, at least down to the third fret, okay? Or at least down to the fifth fret. So we're gonna play this again, nice and slow, all, to, all of it together. Let's try that again. So blue shuffle and G. There's the rhythm right behind it. And then If you want to, you can just give a little bit of a, even at the end. But I think the really important parts here are the, so you're going right into that that D part sooner than I actually, um, yeah, not the D. Little extra note there. All right, there you go, it's Blues Shuffle uh, in G. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please like and subscribe and share, comment. Let me know uh, if you need some help with any type of technique of any kind whatsoever. Uh, please be sure to check out some of my other videos that are um, been focusing a lot on uh, uh, harmonic minors, relationships between uh, pentatonic and the uh, relative minors. Uh, recently, we've done some modes, and uh, we're actually going to continue with the, some relationships between um, pentatonic and natural minors. Um, uh, pentatonics uh, and the relative minor, so the so on and so forth. So we're going to start delving in, into some some flats and sharps. So please check out my other videos. Keep playing and have fun.